make sure you hit the follow button with the notification bell lit um like and subscribe if you're following on youtube with the notification bell on and yes we have a treat today new information them found out didn't know anything about i thought the so-called infamous edp i thought he was gone but apparently he's out still doing the same bs so we're about to just go ahead and jump right into this i have not looked at none of this chiseled adonis is covering it and like i said i did not know he was still going around and everything and still you know doing the same thing that he's saying doing the same thing that he's doing so without further ado we're just gonna jump right into it because this is some bullshit right here straight up all right we're about to see what, what's going on with him because apparently he's back for more cupcakes so we're about to go into this all right so boom i can't believe we're doing this once more would you believe edp 445 got caught talking to underage children again again again, again. again. Hi, hey. my name is kayla and i am unfortunately edp's victim i am six oh my god six. are you serious and edp first started talking to me when i was 15 he messaged me first and i told him my age and he didn't block me what you got me now or you figured me out you bro me again man you got me red handed all right so boom before i even get into it Jadeen this dude sick since pending i guess everybody's in anticipation to see this confrontation between himself and edp in front of the dialysis center where edp was confronted for talking to yet another underage individual i wanted to shout out not only jadeon also master at work and also inside for covering what since transpired and okay so they so they set him up information on what since had gone on with this another sting operation right? oh my god yo this dude and i've said this before and i feel like i've got to double down once more sir have you no shame moreover what's wrong with you because the last what time is I wrong heard with about you about edp it's when the news had broke that he's dealing with stage five kidney disease he's in a situation yeah 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 where he's dialysis for life waiting to get a kidney transplant and or death there are only three options there is no reversing of the kidney disease right no so it's not case, i felt somewhat unfortunately at the time i feel no sympathy for the man based upon what it is that he done did however i felt as if somebody whom i myself my brother not the unchiseled adonis but the unknown adonis who's since been kept off camera he's dealing with kidney disease and kidney failure right now and i wouldn't wish that okay. entire process on my worst enemy so i can sympathize with the unfortunate medical you know yeah the medical part so yes the How medical about, part yes for whatever reason i don't necessarily believe in karma because what he's dealing with is a consequence of his action lack of diet you know what diet and all the other stuff man. I mean, please if you but i would please seek in that moment exercise your body is failing you you were projected to pass in six months, but somehow you're still here. So it makes me wonder the, the validity of the claims. But nevertheless, I thought maybe something would click. He'd have a come to Jesus moment, per se. I would think to that, stop too. The very same actions that had since put you as a top 10 vilified individual, rightfully so, in the country, across the globe, because really the Internet is global. But for whatever reason, you're still doing the exact same actions. Like, that's crazy to me. It did nothing. Yeah. Bro, Clip. I can't stand this. We got ja Rule on the phone. Let's see what Ja's thoughts are on this tragedy. I guess not. Who gives a fuck what Ja Rule thinks at a time like this? Like, this is ridiculous. <laughs> Back in 2021, when the entire debacle since came forward of him talking to underage women, he was confronted on the video from the CC unit and Shet Goldstein and all this oh, stuff. Yeah, he yeah, got yeah. off scot-free because it was a faulty investigation on how everything yeah went yeah i remember that bs that's so stupid he wasn't held accountable outside of the court of public you know uh, uh, um viewership i guess i should say no right? he wasn't then he's since ostracized from 
social media things of that nature he's for all social he's media canceled, youtube running his own website which is still active right now which is yeah to me, but I yeah he yeah move the website right for i forgot about that he but he do got his own website happening this man's still doing the exact same behavior remember when he was defending his actions or i should say trying to deny the accusations he went on and on about his disgust about talking to underage women he keeps but saying then, that shit but here he is still again with verifiable evidence talking to underage women i got this clip from inside's channel and it's him sending voice notes to the supposed underage girl about what he would like to do to her she said is this the real edp or just a fan account if it's real edp you should make more tiktoks you're funny my friends and i are 15. we love watching them straight up she says her age she says she's underaged immediately yeah i see it right there the very first reply so edp is fully aware of her age there's a lot of dms here i can't show you all of them because some of them are pretty bad damn but here's some of them keep in mind when you're reading these dms this is a 15 year old that edp is talking to oh. he says let me see What the fuck? Dude, you sick. Wow. Dang. You said just let me control you and shut up. Holy bro. And EDP is straight up acting like an e-girl right now, saying good night good morning hitting her up first bro he's absolutely going crazy in these dms right now he even sent her some crazy voice messages oh lord i hope not i will say though this is kind of fucking random i remember the very first time i ever ate pussy man i'm not sure if you heard about it online i'm dead yo bro back in the day i was dating a school teacher she was like in her 40s no she was like 39 i was like 28 oh my fucking god i'll say this man like that shit was fucking that shit was scrumptious as fuck i have never been this disgusted in oh my America. god yeah very graphic details about things the that hell? you shouldn't be talking to kids about you know now this message this message takes the cake for me right here this was like crossing the line yes a line this is way across that line oh what the hell are you talking about taking somebody in Virginia? Bro, you. I want that son of a bitch dead. I want him dead. I want you to get this fuck where he breathes. I want him dead. I want his family dead. I want his house burnt to the ground. I want to go to the middle of the night. I want to piss on his ass. In the midst of all of Bro. He himself Why in the world you want to sit up there? He is talking about I would. Bro, like. <sighs> I keep trying to sit up there and trying to I'm trying to like digest this a little bit. This dude willingly know the the chick told him that he that she was 15 yet he still texting her making obscene audio messages. And then just the message just sent a while ago. Talking about taking her virginity. Bro, like, you, what are you on, man? And you just got caught. Like, year, two years ago? You right back to the same thing? Bro. Hope this is not a setup. If it was a setup or something like that, I'm already carrying. I'm going to make sure that I got armed security. All of these precautions that mm -mm -mm. he's willing to do in an effort to meet an underage child. What does that say about him? All right, so in oh, order shit. for me not to know it's not a fucking setup, especially with chicks what? that I meet on dating apps and shit, and, and especially with chicks who knows who I am as far as like YouTube, online, the videos and shit, motherfucker. We must meet up in a public setting 
no video he's still cameras, no record. Bro, you still. You're literally still trying to meet up with this chick. EDP, what's wrong with you, man? What's wrong with you, man? And you got, and that's a voice message. That is your voice that's in that message. And you sending lengthy audio messages too. Recording none of that fucking bullshit. Um, I'll have a fucking armed guard outside the fucking building. You feel me? And when you show up, nigga, I gotta fucking pat you down and damn this strip search your ass to make sure you ain't got no wires. Make sure you ain't got no audio recording this devices, dude. any of that mother nigga. You do all that. All right, cool. It's not a setup. All right, what's going on? Let's talk. <laughs> you know what I mean? I I, I just I, I I just don't trust motherfuckers anymore. I don't trust. Niggas. I don't give out my address. I don't give out my number. If I do give you my. Don't nobody actually see me do this. I'm going to do this right here. The hell wrong with you, EDP? You just recorded yourself, dumbass. You don't need a... She doesn't need a wire. You basically just laid out everything right there. I swear he's so dumb. My number is a Google Voice number. You feel me? I just don't. I can't believe this dude is doing this. I'm sorry, man. Like I'm just and burping on that last bro. You experienced is... two years ago. I'm all about shooting motherfuckers first and asking questions second. You know, I remember I was fuck, at the gas dude? station once. No bullshit. I was getting gas, and I had my fucking I had my 357 Magnum on me. I'm chilling, loaded, right? You got exposed two years ago. You got off scot-free, somehow was able to escape it. And you still doing the same behavior. Listen to this shit. If I tried to like set him up in any sort of meetup, he would kill me and everybody else there. But Whoa. I'm telling you right now. If you fuck me over. This shit goes wrong in any fucking way, shape, or form. Give your soul to the Lord. What? Because your ass belongs to me. What are we doing? What are we doing? We got to <laughs> execute I, I this man, bro. Three sword style. Send him to the <laughs> upper room. Hey yo, Adonis, I'm all up for it, bro. I'm all up for it. Three sword style. I'm all up for it, bro. What the hell are you on, EDP? Seriously, what are you on? Like, this is like upsetting. This is pissing me off. This is not even my daughter, but it's pissing me off. That's that's stupid. That is crazy. He he need to be in the psych ward. He need to be in a psych ward. To be dealt with, you shall be deleted! There's actual messages of me telling my age to him several times. And there's voice messages of other victims that he groomed. I mean, regardless of the situation, Kayla, I don't give a fuck. Like, she's like, oh, I'm going to ruin your life. Whoa. If you think that you can ruin that bitch any more than what it's already been ruined, you go right the fuck ahead. Be my fucking guest, bitch. As a matter of fact, motherfucker, I'll get front row tickets to see this fucking shit, dude. You know what I mean? It's like, I really, I really don't give a shit anymore. You know what I mean? Mind you, the actual video from GD on Bro. hasn't even been released yet. EDP had came out with a statement himself on his website, and this is what he had to say. I'm gonna cut straight to the fucking chase, man. You know what I mean? I'm talking about Jideon, right? This nigga decided to. He don't need to be saying anything. Across country, tried to catch me in the act on some fucking bullshit. Motherfuckers 
tracked me down. Niggas stalked me. Niggas camped outside of my motherfucking dialysis center. The fact that you flew cross country, you feel me, to fuck with somebody. Not to mention, nigga, this is my motherfucking dialysis center. This is life or fucking death, bro. Niggas don't understand that I need this fucking shit to live. I couldn't I, see I, I can't stand this dude, this bro. I can't stand this dude. Roof. We do not care. Hey, man, exactly. According to Gideon, hey, fuck it. You know what I mean? It's all about the views. It's all about the fucking money. I guess if the fucking price is right, my nigga, you'd probably be down with becoming a fucking gay-ass male porn star sucking dick in front of the whole fucking world and shit. You know, hey, fuck it, my nigga. As long as they slime me, my nigga, that $5 million check, I'm down with fucking, you know, turning on the fucking camera. I'm down with, you know, laying up on my back and getting my dick sucked by another fucking guy. You feel me? Fuck it. Damn, it's all boy, about the dude. money. It's all Ooh, about the views, right, Gideon? Fuck it, right? And then, and then it didn't fucking end there. I had to go to the surgical center, right? To have a chest port put in my fucking chest. This motherfucker followed me across town, 20 fucking, 20, 25 miles across town. Hey, EDP, man, we just want a fucking word. Really, nigga? I just came out of fucking surgery videotaping me without my fucking consent videotaping what kind of fucking car i drive hiding behind that whole little faggot ass bullshit oh well you know technically you can't do anything you know this is the fucking excuse they like to fucking make when they don't want to get knocked the fuck out and then you know have the police come and you know tell the motherfuckers to leave right you know well technically you know you know you can't do anything because we're filming on public property. Really, nigga? I right, cool. People don't understand how kidney failure and how dialysis affects the human body. You know what I mean? Oh, well, here goes EDP again, trying to pay himself out to be the victim. You know what? Listen, motherfucker. Like I said before in my past videos. I did not even know live, anything about. Turn, hold on, hold on. Conscrew I did not know anything about Gideon was was actually behind this dude like that. I ain't even know anything about all this. This is all new to me. Yeah, I know Gideon had did some things with um what was it? One of the one of the Paul brothers, Logan Paul, Jake Paul, one of them. I think it's Logan Paul. I know they had a little scuffle before like a while back, but I did not know he was like all under all i would say all under edp skin like that i did not know that so he's kind of like i'm pretty sure this is coming from his website because that's the only that's the only thing i can think of that he has because i don't think he have a youtube um he got a, a, a that's instagram but i don't think he's posting anything on instagram i don't know but i did not know he was getting on his skin like this really this motherfucking video you niggas can chop it up you guys can fucking snort it on some nose candy shit you guys can do whatever the fuck you want to do you know what i mean because at this fucking point my nigga listen bitch you guys are going to have your fucking yeah. opinions about me at the end of the day listen man just like shia labeouf said i don't give a fuck what you think i really don't fucking care what the fuck you think about me you know what i mean and so you niggas can sit back and claim that i'm painting myself as the fucking victim all the fuck you want the fact that this nigga had no regard for my motherfucking life that day tells and shows a lot about this nigga's character, you feel me? The fact that I could have fucking died because I was not able to get fucking treatment that day because this bitch ass nigga, because this punk ass motherfucker just goes to show you that this generation is fucked. No! 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 I'm gonna exactly. fast forward to the live stream. He wanted me to address all this shit. You know what I mean? Um, oh, you should go get help. <sighs> this dude, boy. I, like, seriously. He gets on my... He's getting on my damn nerves right now, because... This is like null and void. If you... if you don't care 
about what anybody thinks. Why are you making this making that long ass video? If you don't care, why are you calling out Gideon? You trying to sit up there and say, yes, this is. Oh, he's making it seem like, oh, I couldn't take I couldn't go into diocese because of him. You could have easily walked right past him. Just no comment, no nothing like that. No, because you want to be the big guy. You want to be vulgar, just like you're doing now. Like you got to address everybody all the damn time. Like if you really don't care that much, why are you making this long ass video? Like it doesn't make any sense. You saying you claiming all this stuff, but you in denial like a motherfucker, yo, for real. You in denial. All caps. Denial. Help. You should do this. You should do that. You know what I mean? You should address this publicly. You know, this and that. Maybe they don't I have to do that. Publicly. Maybe this is something I'd rather handle up in a private manner, my nigga. Maybe this is something I don't want to fucking talk about. You call yourself a nigga, you call yourself a true friend? If you were a true fucking friend, you would understand and you would respect my wishes as opposed to pinning me in a fucking corner and forcing me to talk about something I don't want to talk about. Oh, well, you should go get help. Oh, I just want to see you. you should, get hey. Who's to say that I'm... Hey, you do need some help, bro. I don't care. I don't care what you about to say right now on this next part of the video. I don't care. You need help. After all that stuff we done seen, bro, you need serious help. Like serious help. I ain't talking about no dialysis treatment. I ain't talking about none of that stuff. You got the surgery you had on your chest. None of that. You need psychological help because for some reason you are still trying to go with the underage children check 15 bro like seriously i mean she like she looks nice and all but that don't give you no reason to talk to her soon as she came off and said she was 15 you should have just sat up there and just dumb that shit down or just in your case don't even talk to her at all you already got caught it wasn't legitimate okay cool when somebody decides to put this type of information up they're gonna go right back to the other the last information you had two you know two years ago when you allegedly got caught. Bro, you need to leave them girls alone. You need help. I'm not already talking to somebody. Dang, yeah, he lied. That I'm not already going out and, um, you know, talking to a counselor, talking to a therapist. If you are, it ain't working. Here's the disconnect, right? Here's, you know, where my generation, people who are 30 in their 40s, nigga, we known as OGs now, you feel me? Um, all the little punk ass motherfucking faggots who are 29, well, 28, 27 years old and fucking younger, bitch ass niggas, motherfuckers, you fuck them, right? This is yes, the sir. disconnect that the OGs, ages 30, to 40 are having with these little young ass motherfuckers right not everything has to be done on camera god damn if i'm fucking what nigga if i'm going to go see my fucking shrink motherfucker do i have to video camera that shit too do i have to record that shit what if i want to do it privately i just wanted to come on here and um let you guys know how much of a piece of shit this motherfucking jideon is you know what i mean Nigga don't give a damn. You know, I could have fucking fell over and died up on the fucking 11th. He wouldn't have given a shit. Let's fucking bust out this camera. Let's record EDP's lifeless ass fucking body up on the fucking ground. Hey, fuck it. As long as we getting views, that's all that fucking matters, right? This fat son of a bitch, he's fat! As you saw, he prefaced <laughs> his entire response under three different things. One, 
that Jadeon was doing all of this under the guise of just getting views. Did not really care about his well-being. If he dropped dead right there, nobody would really give a fuck. They would record his lifeless body because it's all about views on social media. Two, yeah. he was inconvenienced because he did not get treatment for dialysis that particular day because his blood pressure had went through the roof. And while he was departing, here he was then, I guess, ambushed with an interview on the spot. And then ultimately, three, feeling as if he was betrayed by somebody who he since called a friend. Right, and this could have been dealt with in a private manner. Here's what I'll say to all of that. Okay. Did you not think once in this eight minute, that's how long of it, by eight minutes, nine seconds, reaction to what since transpired? You not once acknowledged what the entire basis of you being interviewed, approached, interrogated, ambushed was even about. It's as if if he don't talk about it, it doesn't exist. My man. Exactly. This is like the third time, fourth, to fifth. Nobody knows the actual amount of times in which you had been messaging underage people, whether they actually underage, staged as underage, but you received messages with somebody saying on their phone, hey, I'm 15, They're 15. I'm, 13, I'm 14, I'm 16, and you still move forward not only messaging but then getting sexually explicit in messages where you're trying to i'm not necessarily coerce but you're in a situation to where you're willing to and in some states like hell if not now nah, i'm not even gonna say some in most states just doing that alone can get you time because there's a show that's going around right now it's probably they haven't put any more shows up. I think it's like two seasons up. I said under under age, undercover, under age. It's something like that. It's a it's an A and E type show. But they do that. They find people that does that, and you get caught. You know, having messages and stuff like that. You can go get tell. You can get jail time for that. And then on top of that, you know, even more your time if you agree to meet up, you know, he, he needs help, man. He needs major help. Gage in sexual acts, coital affairs with underage people, and you send to not even acknowledge that and not acknowledge in it. your reaction to all of this. Sir, fuck you. I hope you die. Like, that. I, I, I'm not even a type of person <laughs> who cheers on somebody's downfall. Who cheers for somebody to mess that's, around? That's that's. But you've learned nothing. See, he feels exactly like I feel. Like I don't wish nothing on nobody. But that display that Adonis just showed, and what I just showed, that's the type of stuff that don't normally come out of us. But because we see this mess firsthand again from EDP. It pisses us off like to no extinct because it's like he's doing this. Nothing is happening. At least for right now. You know, it's it's crazy. Like, bro, like this is this doesn't make no sense. Now I don't and it I know there's some people, there are probably some unorthodox people out there in the internet and everything like that. Screw you. If you sitting out here thinking that, oh, you know, you you just can't sit up there and do that to him. No, uh-uh, man. 15 is 15, yo. You don't need to be sitting up here. And the chick looked like she 15. But even if she wasn't 15, she told him straight up she was 15. He still went for I can sit up there and mess him and say I'm 15. And he'll still sit up there and still mess me and talk to me and stuff like that and everything. Like I'm... Like I'm an underage. He didn't say he didn't acknowledge nothing about, oh well, you're underage. I can't talk to you. He ain't say be like, oh, we're just gonna keep it like this or keep it like no, nah, he went right on ahead like she was 18 and up. This dude need help. <laughs> I've been saying this the whole time. He need help. You sat here and you said, Oh, how what 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 tells you that I'm not already getting counseling? What tells you that I'm not? You're not getting any. 
Sir, you not once took accountability, responsibility for your actions publicly. This nope. doesn't exist. It's like you feel as if you've been slighted, you've been done wrong. Sir, you're committing a crime, physically, <laughs> morally, emotionally. Exactly. What's wrong with you? You publicly talked about, well, you want, you possibly could be heading to the deathbed, all of this. There's no form of repenting. There's no form of apologetic, you know, uh, nope. thoughts inside he, of he, your mind. I don't even think he's even going to do it. You think it's everybody against you? You're a victim? No, you're, you're a perpetrator. You're a predator. Exactly. This man need to be dealt with. It's crazy to me. And I would have not even talked about it. Because remember, I said I was pretty much done with this subject. But I've received an ungodly amount of emails and DMs. Text messages. People sending me mess all the time. To, yo, yo, the, over the course of the past week. And a half, yo, you talk about what happened to EDP, yo, you got to talk about EDP, yo, it's getting crazy, sending me videos, all the stuff, I want to stay away Damn. from it. But every time you keep showing up unprovoked, and I keep seeing this, it's crazy to me how you keep moving this way, and you can't look yourself in the mirror and see, yo, I'm a fucked up individual. Let me publicly say I'm fucked up. Something wrong with me. I'm not only getting public help, but I'm a disgusting human being. Take accountability for it. He's not trying this to do that. He's threatening to murder a child oh, that. if he happens to get set up that he's here to possibly engage, or I can't even really say possibly, that he's going to engage he's going to. with the under, uh, underage individual. This man threatening to harm somebody. That's the shit that bothers me. That's what bothers me, and that's what sets me up on a on a on the edge a little bit. Cause firsthand, you're sitting up there, you send it, and then his his dumb, stupid ass gonna sit up there and gonna send these messages, do all of this, do all of that, make a video. Like you got to be the dumbest guy I've ever seen, but at the same time, you need help. You need serious help. The logic is screwed up. No nuts and bolts are not tight up in here. They, they're not at all. Like, this is like crazy. Like, this is worse than the first time. The first, the first time the dude was, he was cracking jokes. Couldn't even, couldn't even actually be credible with him because he was low key being a little racist and everything like that. And white guys in out here cracking fat jokes on the black guy and this and that, so on and so forth. He had issues beforehand and everything like that, you know, racial issues and stuff. It wasn't credible. Now, two years go by, up until now, and apparently this been going on for a week, just like he said, quoted from Adonis. And everybody else that's been messaging him. That he's still back to the same BS. Like this dude needs some help, man. He needs some serious help. And then on top of that, nobody, not nobody seem to be like getting on his case right now. Or they trying to build up a case. I don't know. Maybe they trying to build up one. But it need to be dealt with really, really soon. Because... That me that message about him taking out like dealing with her because he being set up, bro. Yeah, that right there, that's enough to be like, yeah, you're done, bro. You're done. He needs to be like locked up and get some help. If they disclose and or try to set him up for having pedophilic quarter affairs. With an underage girl, like, we all, like, I know you're on the other end of the ledge, disgusted. I, I, I can't put into words the rage. The, the, this right here, <laughs> this man needs to be stoned. Eliminated, bruh. The, I don't know what else to say. I really don't know what, to, uh, what else to say. My last final thoughts will be to when the video is released. I'll give my reaction to that. But this right here, especially... 
Not even just the information that since came out where they leaked the chats and everything of that nature. His response to it all, not even acknowledging acknowledging nothing his role in all of this making it seem as if it's the entire world he skipped him. over that whole thing basically your mother is incredibly ashamed of you there's nobody who you held in higher esteem higher regard than your mother i want you to understand right now your mother wherever she may be in the afterlife she is disgusted with you she no longer wants to associate herself with you she no longer wants to be attached to in any form hey, hey, with say, yo. whatsoever. I'm pretty sure your father has since disowned you. You didn't really like him like that, whatever the case may be. I hope you're all alone for the remainder of your days. And when you do pass, I hope it's in the most brutal way under the sun, sir. Because you deserve everything that is coming to you. You have earned everything that is coming to you. You're a piece of shit. You're a terrible human being. And I cannot wait. I cannot wait until you get exactly what is coming to you. That's all I got to say about that for now. I look forward to seeing Jadeon's video. You let it be known in the comment section what you think about this situation. Because as far as I'm concerned, this man can eat all kinds of dicks. EDP's live on TikTok. I don't want to see that shit. Make sure you guys I'm report it to TikTok. To I don't want to make it no oh, money. Man. I just EDP's do not deserve money. I just think that you should take this time to own up to it yeah own up to it bro i'm coming from a friend brian like this is coming from me i've known you for 10 years i've known you for 10 years bro brian like, i just think that now's the time to just own up to it because as you look back on it you should have done it in the first place w friend right like that's that's what you should have done the first time and you probably would still have your youtube channel and all this stuff granted like granted like you know your reputation still would have been kind of you know, tarnished, but people would have looked at you different. Help, bro, in prison. <laughs> Forget it, man. You're, I'm, I'm trying to explain it the best way I can. You're not even, it's not coming out the right way. Just... I, I understand what you're saying, Brian. Listen to your friend. And don't Admit think it. that I don't. But, Complete. even as you're talking about it right now, you know what happened, right? So, I mean, what's what's to hurt and owning up to it the only thing that can come of it is positivity to owning up to what you've done that's the only thing that can come of it want to sit back and nail me in a fucking corner and shit like no that's not what i wanted to do so why the fuck are we talking about this shit we could have talked about this shit privately i tried to talk to you privately you didn't want to talk about it well the fuck you know i was at work all weekend I, I was still messaging you and you said you didn't want to talk about i know where you working bro You know what, man? Let's change the fuck about it. Dude, I'm trying to, man, and I just... Like, you know, that you should kind of, like, address it and just kind of, like, own up to it, admit your fault, and tell them your next step and, you know, like, getting help, or... Oh, like, sure. that's what people... I'll... Sure, I'll address the shit up in a video on the website. How's that? I mean, yeah, you could do that, but, I mean, you're basically addressing it now. Or is that not good? Should I, address it? should I address it now, or is that not good? I don't know. Brian... Don't act like I'm, not that. I'm not coming at you fucked up. I'm just trying to get an un un understanding. Like, I want to, you know, is it cool if I talk about is it cool if I talk about it on the website or should I just? I say fuck the website and just do it here. Of course. If you could guess, Brian, why do you think we're here? Why not? Could you could you answer me that, Brian? Brian. Don't be like this, Brian. I just have a few questions. Is a no good, lousy. Hold on. Oh, so this is his Twitter. We live in a day and age where little stink ass hoes can go around here purposely trying to set niggas up. Bitch, get a life. Get off the fucking internet. Bro, you are really in, you are really your hardest trying to engage with young females. And you sitting up here talking about some purposely setting people up. Dude, she just sat up there and said she was 15. You still went on here and talked to her. So who's setting who's setting anybody up? You setting your dumb ass up, bruh. I might not this stream might not get that big, 
or whatever like that my channel might not get that big but for most important i hope he sees this because really I'm pretty sure I'm saying it. I'm pretty sure everybody else is saying it. You're setting yourself up. And I'm not encouraging your BS. But at the same time, you can't sit around pointing this person, pointing at that person, making it seem like that it's their fault. They want you to own up to the shit. They want you to own up to it. Show some ownership to it. Take accountability. Do something in that nature. You're making it seem like it's not there. You Stevie Wonder to the shit. You know, you act like you don't know what's going on. You don't see nothing. Everybody can sit up there and ask you the, the whole W's. Who, what, when, where, how. You know. Well, the last one won't W. But still, they asking all these questions. You don't know nothing. Bro, this dude, hell. I don't even know how the hell he even back on social media in general. The only thing he don't have is YouTube. He on IG. Now clearly he's clearly he's on Twitter. That's if his Twitter page is still up. I don't even know if it's still up. When was this? The third? What's the day? The seventh? Yeah, it's been about week. It's been like a week. And a whole lot of people is seeing this. So they know of him and everything, so... Son of a hey, hey, That's he's... exactly what he is. But he's a no-good bastard for what he did, and he ought to burn in hell for it. You mean to tell me you watched the entire video, okay. but you haven't... That's the end of that. Bro, I'm tired of talking about him for one night. But best believe, I'm gonna be... I'm going to be following up on this stuff, because... Just like me and Adonis have been saying, and a few other people, he needs to be dealt with. In the worst way. Because this mess don't make any sense. It doesn't. It does not make any sense. And if you with me about it and everything like that. Hit the like button. Follow me. Because I'm basically going to be trying to cover this up too. I'm trying to cover this up. He's still trying to eat more cupcakes. And all this other BS. Man. I'm going to be on that ass. Just as much as the next person. Because it don't make no sense y'all does not make any sense but yeah this makes no you know what yeah that that just spoiled the whole night you know a little bit I, it ain't spoiled my night but it's just it's just the whole thing is that he doesn't take accountability over the stuff that he's doing and it just don't make any sense man doesn't make any sense at all.